Hey, how's it going, everybody? Midweek war attacks. We are rush attack again. Purple tanks. Only about six Alfreichs, which is nice. It was only one last war, so this is a step up from that, but not too much worse. Uh, I'm going to go for this team first. We've got about five left going for the reset. Um, so I'm going to choose one of these. And this is what I have. So... Rush attack teams are a totally different thought process for me, and some of this video is just going to be me talking about my thought process behind that as I try to craft a team for what I'm looking at. So, what I'm seeing here is a is a dangerous tank. Um, he's not at an advantage to how he normally is because he's normally very fast, but he is built for full attack. So. This is a situation where I could see the advantage of going multiple yellows. Um, it's a little bit of a gamble because I don't have the troops to support that. However, he's going to go down pretty easily. So if I can take him out, the next concern is Mother North. Obviously the right side is where the real damage is, but Fenrir is not much of a factor until later on, so I'm not worried about that. June is without costume, so he still hits hard, but not as crazy as you as he could, um, so it'd be, it'd be using, um, mana control to stop Mother North and kill her next, so I'm thinking that I might do that, in which case, which team would I want to use, I think I would probably go with a Gazelle, Jackal, Odin, and then... I uh, probably need to use my stronger Proteus just in case, and then a Regard. And then we'll just focus on tile damage. So, um, actually, and I'm going to switch the troops in this way as well, again, to emphasize tile damage, because we have an 892 attack stat versus 766. So, bigger troop, better stat. In fact, I may want to just put the... So, without three level 11 troops. I need to think about who I want to fire first. Um, and Odin is probably more impactful, honestly. So we'll put the ninja troop on Jackal, which, you know, will be a massive boost to attack. 25% um, more is big. So probably three yellows will take out Kage. Um, and then, yeah, this, this is actually pretty good. The troops are not perfect but that's okay so i gotta think we're very fast here um so yeah i think this looks good oh god i hate that so that was i forget what order i did the troops did i do I should probably do 23 on odin swap that to ninja so Odin's got a decently high attack stat too, so we'll boost that up even more. This is not the right healer to bring. So, because Gazelle will dispel his heal. Okay, so we have a good chance of taking out the tank quickly, which will really cut the legs off this team. So let's see if we can get it. Oops, shit. Ooh. Alrighty. So it's not there. We don't have what we need. We need something more to happen. So what is that going to be? I could match the horizontal greens to maybe bring another yellow in. Um, how can I set up purple matches though? I've got obviously those reds into Fenrir wouldn't be too bad. His hit will be weak at the beginning. can do this without disrupting any yellow matches, so I think I'm going to. Oh man, so close. Uh... Okay, so we're not going to stop Kage. So this gives me a couple chances. 
Ooh, hits the healer. That's not good. All right, so this will allow me to make two yellow matches. These four should kill him. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. All right, so we have to go for damage reduction. Got purples down the middle, so hopefully without any cascades, I can freeze the left side. We don't have enough tiles on here for Odin, so with only one hit coming in, I might save Gazelle. Otherwise, I run the risk if I if I save Gazelle, I run the risk of setting off a cascade and getting hit by Zimkitha and Fenrir. So let's use Gazelle. Let's get our purples going. Okay, no cascade. We got in just in time for this side. So we'll heal. No, um, what's it called? Mono shield. So that's good. And then we want to make plays on the side over here. Oh man, we're not getting enough. Oh, these are just out of reach. Okay, so 325 is nothing. Need to make one more attempt to get more yellows. Crap. Oh, great. Oh, great. Come on! Alright, Gazelle is toast. We gotta try to kill Mother North. I don't think there's enough yellows on the board, but we gotta try to make it happen. Oh, 300. God, with defense down, that was weak. Can we get that freaking yellow? Okay, no Kage, that's good. We lost Jackal. Alright. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Oh, God. Dead. Fuck. Alright, so we just gotta try to make these yellows work for us. Of course, she mono shields. Dead. Fuck. That was a shitty board. That was a shitty, shitty board. Okay, uh, let me regroup here. Okay, so... I'm not gonna make that mistake again, and... Not that it was a mistake, but it was a gamble that didn't pay off, and I'm gonna go for special skills again instead of trying to stack colors. So, I don't wanna go for an Ursina Black Knight, or... I'm gonna go here first, and we're gonna bring, Mickey's gonna join us, who's up here on the Titan team. Um, what else are we going against here? Kunshin. Um, <laughs> I think I'm gonna also bring a, I don't wanna bring all my mono control on one team, but I think I'm gonna bring Hansel, anyone else down here? Actually, no, let's bring Lady of the Lake also. There's no real hitters in the center. Um, and then, is it worth bringing an ailment blocker or just a cleanser? I think it's worth bringing an ailment blocker. Health stealing is probably a good thing here. And then we really need some more danger. So, one healer, she could be enough. We've got a silence and an attack boost. Um, I'm going to save Loki for a... Alfrike team. Mm, I'm gonna try this approach actually. And then who do I wanna bring for my last hero? I don't wanna go full rainbow here, so where would it be nice to double up? It could be nice to bring Kingston to pull some of the attack power out of 
the only real hitter here. So we got ailment block, we got heal, we got minions, we got silence. So maybe I'll throw Kingston here in case I can't survive a snipe. All right, let's just go for it. Okay, great. So, oh God. So I've got reds in three moves. But there's going to be some cascades. Let's start here. I hope a yellow comes in just to speed that up. Nope. Uh, I'm going to go for this one next just to see what kind of luck we might have. No luck is the answer. Um, yeah, we got to get our ailment block up here. Okay. There's no benefit to yellows. Looking at that purple diamond, but what I really need is I have the blues. It's not going to stop um, Cunchin, but we're just going to ignore that effect. Um, is there a better way I can make this match? Hmm. I'm gonna do a few cascades first. So let's put up our protection against Kunchin. We're not so worried about him getting, them getting the heal because uh, they're already at full health. Put our minions up. I probably wanna silence, yeah, Black Knight over. Is there one turn left on this? So we need to set off Vela. I probably wanna silence Black Knight over Vela since I have the potential to block the ailment there. So kinda have to waste a turn here to make sure Vela goes off. I'll take a little damage, but the minions should still survive-ish. Um, okay, so we're silenced over there. So now we need to think about greens. And be nice to get purples going again. So if I can just keep this green team rolling, we're going to be looking pretty good. Um, so yeah, greens are the immediate priority because we don't want anyone to fire. So we have silence for next turn, so we don't have to worry about that. This might kill White Rabbit. Uh, those minion hits going to do it? Nope. But again, we have ailment blocking up, so let's see if we can get the greens, and we do. And now we are doing real good. Hmm, the question is, who do we want to silence? Uh, we have ailment protection up. So I'm not so much worried about those others. So let's silence Black Knight. Maybe we can kill this guy. Not quite. Why was that so weak? Minions. Kill him anyways. Wow. Three um, sword minions alive and, and two heroes and Vela still goes off. Crazy. So we're just going to renew that subscription to Silence Magazine for Black Knight. Just because that's the kind of nice people that we are. All right, 
And death by minions. Not that I even needed to summon more of those. So what I'm curious about finalizing in my own mind is when Vela hits, which minions is she going to hit? Is she going to kill that sword minion when she fires on Lady of the Lake? Or does she hit from the left side first? She hits from the right side. Interesting. And new minions go to the... So yeah, the most recent minions fired are the ones that are the most buried, which is not what I would have thought. Okay, well that worked. And then we're just about there. Alright, pause here. Alright, we're back with an Alfreich. Um, this is largely cleaned up and ready to reset, but we got a few of these sticky teams left. So one thing I'm thinking is um, Gravemaker. Um, did I use Vanda? Oh, shoot. That doesn't work quite as well. Okay. Maybe Grizzul and Marjana. And the cool thing about Marjana is with the costume bonus, she only needs a level one mana troop. So I can fire all these at very fast speed. It's not really the red that I want, but I need ailment protection. Yeah, this is not the strongest attack power, though. Hmm. Could, could work, though. Um, okay, and then with this, we would add... Uh, I guess we need some mana control. I gotta not forget to use my double, um, Gillen Bursties. Okay, so... Let's look at this. We don't have to worry about Mitsuko's Reflect. We're gonna need to get either two purples or two, two purple matches or two red matches before Alfreich. Um... That should be pretty doable. Um, and then we got attack up, defense down, and Gravemaker should do some pretty decent damage under those um, circumstances. So no snipers, so pretty, pretty safe. So the key is just, can we beat Alfreich? And we'll find out. It's nice to have two colors as your option there. So... Oh boy. Oh boy. So one move I'm looking at is dragging this to the right. It'll get me one red match, but I think that's too risky, so I'd rather hit Mitsuko and just hope one more purple falls in and then I can use the dragon bomb to get that match All situated the other option is I can match this Drag this down to match the greens Purples fall through there's another chance a purple comes down the middle and then I'll have two purple matches right from the start That's probably the smartest move to make um, instead of matching for four and then still needing that second match Let's do that. Let's see if we can get another purple to come down. No. Uh oh. So the other option is we could try this red down the middle to try to get a purple here. Or if a purple lands here, we can match it to the side, but that'll probably be too late. Alfreich will be charged, so. The only problem with doing the suggested match and trying for purple again, or red into purple, if a red lands here, is that Mitsuko might charge and then take my mana away, and then I'm in some big trouble. I think that's my best shot. I'd rather get hit by... Oh, come on. I'd rather get hit by Mitsuko than Alfreich. All right, we gotta try this. Oh, fuck. 
doesn't hit everyone, but the ones that she missed do not help me. Damn it. Oh my god. This is not really that great of a move, but I don't have great moves. No, 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 no. Ah. Watch Mother North bring her right back. Um, so I can't charge purple yet. God. 123, she's going to go off again. That should be certain death. So what's... I'm trying to think of my next move after. Two turns left on that. I'm screwed. <sighs> I don't want to match the reds either because that's going to cause Gravemaker to injure someone, but not much I can do. Just watching horror as Mother North revives the whole team. Um, guess we can try to get reds again. All right. Oh God, Mother North. No, no, no. All right, we gotta get reds. Didn't need to set her fucking off again. All right, no revive. Sweet. Yes, this is going so good. Okay, at least that happened. Um, this won't set off Mother North, I don't think. Fuck! Come on! If she brings Alfred back. Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, we're gonna try one more of these. Um... Almost the same lineup. This would have even been better for uh, Grizzul, because now we have four ailments on this team. So we're going to try to just not let it get to that point. Uh, which means I probably need to have two forms of mana control. Do we have, what do we have on this team? Um... Yeah, I just think we need two kinds of mana control, so I've already used Mickey, I've already used Lady of the Lake, so that probably means Hansel, did I already use Hansel? No, so that's probably Hansel and Proteus. Ah, Francine is possible, but there's quite a few sniper, yeah, it's, ugh, so we need pretty high damage here. So I'm thinking I'll take my own Frigg and Hansel, Regard, Proteus, and something else. So Frigg, Hansel, um, I don't think Hell can stand up to a sniper shot. Yeah, she can better than Proteus, so I'll bring her. Bring the good regard, and then what else? Loki? I guess that's the third counter. <laughs> it's just be super over the top. Let's spread these out. So if we get hit by, uh, Mitsuko doesn't totally screw that up. Is this totally overkill? I feel like this is totally overkill. Two forms of mana control and my dedicated Alfrag counter in one team. Ooh, because then I have two flags left after this, and I will have 
to Proteus. Okay. In that case, let's do it. Um, uh, all right. <laughs> okay. Oh no 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 motherfucker. Alright, well how do you like that one, bitch? God damn. Uh we're gonna wait. Ah, oh, I can't believe that. Um so we wanna do big moves while this is um, while well, this ailment is active. Psh. Yeah, I realized that wasn't efficient, but I just wanted to smack June around a little bit. All right, what do we need here? Some greens would be nice. We'll take them with the purples with the blues oh god well it's pretty good if you can say you got hit by Alfred and you still won so that was an overkill team but at least I got it and we'll leave them up to the cleanup here hopefully that's an easy cleanup but the one for this cleanup, obviously, you take out Alfred first, and then it's just full firepower on Mother North. The right side is really not dangerous at all. Um, all right, I'll be back. All right, so just my two flags left, and we've lost already, so just got to put a couple teams together to finish this off. See what I can do. Uh, do we have buffs on this team? Hopefully, we don't get to that point. So, let's go with these two purple. Make it Proteus. We'll use the Gill and Bursties on the last team. Um. I don't know if this is going to work yet, but let me just take a shot at what I think I want to use and then see how it looks. What am I going up against here? Um, so yeah, Jabberwock hitting the sides. Another good sniper would be nice. I don't really have buffs. I don't think I can weaken enough with Scotty to make Scotty shine. Hmm. Guess I could just do Liana since she has a costume bonus. I don't need as good of a troop. Um. Yeah, that could be good. So he needs a little bit more. She just needs a level one. All right. Yeah, they just said, if anyone can score 200 points with their last two flags, it's Spock. Oh God, not with these boards though. Green and purple, how about blue and red? Not gonna do it. All right, cross our fingers for a purple. Uh, so we want to get rid of as many tiles as we can right here. Um, I guess this is a good move. Oh, that's gonna suck. All right, 
Bring me back. No, 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 no. Oh, fuck. Alright, resurrection time. Oh my god. Alright, alright. Two hits coming in. Got my purples. So let's just get this dude killed. Um, but I don't have Proteus. So, three, no, two hits coming in. But those purples, yeah, it is going to set off Marjana. So I have to do this, unfortunately. That's not great, but I wanted to try to kill Liana. All right, Melosi's going to hit. Let's see. Those greens will count for four. Only one tile's going to hit. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Come on, Albie. Come on, Albie. What? Gain some mana, dude. Ooh. All right, resurrect time. Yes. Uh, what do we do now? I guess it's a good idea to heal. <laughs> I feel like I'm on borrowed time already. All right, so we really want to kill Liana. Let's get rid of this diamond. All right, green diamond. She's down again, all right. <laughs> well, it's the first time I've actually had fun with a resurrection team. Usually it just does not work. But having two of them on the same team is pretty good. So, how many more turns are left on this counterattack? We do have to be careful of that. Alright, take our chances at resurrecting again. Let's see if we can get Jabberwock back. Let's kill Liana, because no resurrection can happen on their team. We're gonna overheal, and then I'll, I'll just take the reflect damage. All right, let's see if we can get Jabberwock. No, no, we'll kill here. Let's see if we can get Jabberwock again. No. Also no. <laughs> wow, that was pretty cool. I think that's the first video I've ever done where I've had a successful revive. Look at that healthy team. Boom. Well, that was pretty cool. Can't win every war, but that was pretty cool. All right, so now we're gonna go double Gil and Bursties and who knows what else. Let me see what I have left. None of those. Finley and Ariel would be nice. Scotty would be nice. Black Knight. Um, so let's just put these two in because these are really fun to use and do a lot of damage. Actually, this is not the actual team. So where do we have minions? I'm just going to avoid Scotty completely. So the only minion casters I see are... Teleria, oh, right here. Oh, so many minions, and that's lots of points, too. That'll be fun. All right, so we're going to go... Double Gil and Bursty. Um, do we have buffs on this team? 
potentially, so that's another good one. We'll go Finley. We don't need another healer, actually. So maybe we'll throw Black Knight in here as well. I want to make sure Scotty kills minions, so we're going to do this. All right. Okay, that's a much better board than we had previously. Still don't have the, oh, I do have the blues if I match it a different way. So we'll do that. I guess work on some reds. All right, that's only one minion, but we'll take it. All right, now we got Taunt up and the Gill and Bursty Brothers. So none of these colors are helpful to me. If we can get blues down the middle, nope. Oh, all these minions are gonna drive up the damage from Gill and Bursty. Few more minion hits. And they're gonna go off next turn. Alright, so that's not great. And here we go. <laughs> like to get some more stacks going. Man, where were these boards earlier? This is a different game. Perfect timing, except she's probably not going to survive this. <laughs> oh, I killed all the minions. Well, I think Scotty's just going to kill everyone. Alright. Where does that leave me? 238. So we're back to 30 on 30, so... Perfect score is probably right there around 3, maybe 315, 318, something like that. Um, so some great scores on our team, but we just couldn't do it. So that's where we had just too many low scores, and this is what won the match for them, this whole center chunk. All these around 200, so we had 7, 10, 12... So yeah, the majority of us were too far down, unfortunately. So defense did not hold up that well. Let me show you what I was running. We're trying green tanks this time. Um, so this is what I went with. And it didn't do too well from what I saw. So one-shotted. I think the second kill was two attacks. One, two, three. One, two. So that's six for three. Is that all? Yeah. So two hits per. It's decent. Um, yeah, so. Not our war. We didn't lose by much. We lost by... Wow, that's closer than I thought. Uh, we lost by 86 points. But 100% flag usage, so got to be happy about that. But yeah, 86 points. These are pretty low scoring. Low scoring on both sides. Um, but rush attack can be pretty brutal. So... That's the way it goes sometimes. Um, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss any uploads. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.